They say that nothing matches the beauty and romance of Paris. Well, on this island, you'll get a little taste of France mixed with a perfect dose of paradise. We welcome you to Martinique. Although Martinique was discovered in 1502 by Christopher Columbus, it wasn't until the 1630s when the French settled on the island that Martinique really began transforming. Though, I should say, it wasn't until 1902 that it really transformed. The French settled in the northwest section of the island, later known as St. Pierre in the 1630s. Well over 200 years later, the island's volcano, Mount Pele, erupted killing everyone in the city, except one lucky soul who was held in jail. Talk about the wrong place at the right time. Today, St. Pierre is thriving again, and Martinique is a prime destination for shopping, dining, outdoor activities, and some of the most beautiful beaches on Earth. Most cruise passengers will head to the south of the island with its rolling hills and sugarcane fields. It's also where you'll find the most development on the island. On the south side is where you'll find some of the most unique beaches in the world, full of volcanic black sand. You can see the beauty of France throughout the island's architecture as well. One spot our luxury cruise concierges say should not be missed is the Notre Dame de la Bonne Deliverance. This gorgeous church was designed after rural French churches with an aged stucco facade, a tall steeple, and a large clock that villagers rely on. The church is near the Bay of Le Francois, which leads to the prime hotels, restaurants, and beaches, but many visitors bypass this spot in favor of the sand. If beachgoing is your objective, then you need to head south to the Grand Anse de Salinas. As far as beaches go, this one is the celebrity of all beaches in southern Martinique. This large, picturesque beach is where cruise passengers flock when they dock on the island. The beach offers sunbathers, sightseers, and families alike a complete beach experience. Food vendors and merchants line the beach for when you build up an appetite. Unlike a lot of other Caribbean islands, Martinique offers a delicious variety of dining options for visitors. Over 450 cafes and restaurants can be found on the island. They range from high-end gourmet restaurants to smaller merchants who sell local fruit, drinks, and handcrafted crepes. Having both Creole and French influences, diners will have no problem finding something local with the perfect European twist. The result is simply magnifique. Since Martinique is one of France's 27 regions, it has an abundant access to some of the finest French products at a better rate than you'd get at home. The Galleria is the largest mall on the island with several big European brand stores. A more local approach would be to visit the Fort de France's Spice Market, where you can buy local goods, fresh fruits and vegetables, herbs, spices, and unique local flowers. Near the Spice Market, you'll find La Rue Victor Hugo, the main shopping street. This street has something for everyone. It is a beautiful outdoor combination of both the Galleria and the Spice Market. Definitely worth a stop. First-time visitors take a hike or drive to the top of Mount Pele. While this volcano may not be what you picture when you think of a traditional volcano, it's surrounded by lush, rich rainforest. It's an amazing experience. A trip to Mount Pele isn't complete without stopping at the De Paz Distillery. Built in 1651, the rum plant was destroyed by the massive eruption. But in the early 1900s, it was rebuilt and the cane was replanted in the volcanic soil. Today, you can take a tour of the facility and sample or purchase their delicious and unique rums, as well as liqueurs made from orange, ginger, basil, and other local flavors. It's a great way to learn the rum making process and get a feel for the island's past. Thanks for watching and enjoy your next visit to Martinique. Let our LuxuryCruise.com Luxury Cruise Concierges custom create an unforgettable cruise vacation visiting Martinique. Thanks for watching.